Life is not easy at all. There's going to be challenges. You're going to get beat down. That's the way life is. You say... Sort of put a mask on your face and you go home and lay in your bed when no one's looking at you, when you don't have to impress anybody and you're yourself. And fear comes in. Maybe you don't know for sure what's going to be happening in the future and it scares you. Just that fear paralyzes you. And I just want to ask you today do you think you have hope? At some point, everything's going to go south on you. Everything's going to go south and you're going to say, This is it. This is how I end. Now you can either accept that or you can get to work. That's all it is. You just begin. You do the math. You solve one problem and you solve the next one. And it doesn't matter how you get knocked down in life because that's going to happen. All that matters is that you got to get up. You have to get up. Whatever experience you're having right now, it has not come to stay. It has come to pass. Sometimes you have to just back up and go within yourself and pray and meditate and recharge your batteries. Go away, clear your head, and then come back and look at it from a different vantage point. Don't operate while you are under the spell or the effect of what's going on. Don't allow your emotions to control you. We are emotional, but you want to begin to discipline your emotions. If you don't discipline and contain your emotions, they will use you. You don't have to force yourself or motivate yourself to think negatively, to be depressed, to beat yourself up over the head, to feel loaded with guilt. You don't have to make any effort to do that. Your mind is on automatic. It will do that by itself. But if you want to begin to move into your own personal greatness, you've got to be willing to go against the tide. You've got to be willing to harness your will. And say, in spite of this, I'm in control here. I'm not going to let this get me down. I'm not going to let this destroy me. I'm coming back. You ask the bird, what do you want? Man, I want to be diamond. Tell me something I don't know. Everybody wants it. But the raw reality of it is, everybody don't get it. And the crazy thing is, if you want it, you can get it. It's not like somebody is stopping you or holding a gun to your head and telling you you can't get it. It's a matter of will. It's a matter of hard work. It's a matter of sacrifice. It's a matter of dedication. It's a matter of commitment. The difference is not the genetic code, the potential. It's a guy that's willing to get knocked down, finally tested on fortune, stand back up. The perseverance to see it through, the never say die attitude. We know the battle ahead. We know the journey ahead is going to get tough. We know we're going to face obstacles. We know it's going to be some discomfort. We know they're going to try to break us. We know they're coming for us. We know that's going to happen already. So let's make up in our minds before the battle that we're going to be victorious. Don't cry to give up. Cry to keep going. Don't cry to quit. You already in pain. You already hurt. Get a reward from it. At the end of pain is success. You're not going to die because you're feeling a little pain. You tell yourself, I won't give up. When that depression hits you, come out of nowhere. You tell yourself, I won't give up. There's no guarantee that because somebody is now down on their luck, they can never come back. Who can guarantee that you can't make it? That you can't have your dream? Who can guarantee that you can't do what you want to do? No one can do that. No one can predict that. You don't know what the possibilities are for your life. Because if you're willing to go through all the battling you got to go through to get to where you want to get, who's got the right to stop you? It's your right to listen to your gut. It ain't nobody's right to say no after you earn the right to be where you want to be and do what you want to do. All we need to do is we look at our dreams. As we get ready to hit the floor, I am blessed and highly favored. I don't care if you're sick. I don't care what you're going through. If you're not dead, he ain't through with you yet. As long as you're waking up, you're still in the game. As long as you're alive, you can still make it happen. As long as that breath in your nostrils, boo, you're still in the game. You still can win. Now get your butt up.